I am sure you got used to my uh, usual prop, the uh, yeah, kind of motion detector thing, activate the relay Arduino uh, setup. However, that's not what I want to talk about today. I want to talk about these. These are like, uh, they are sold as, um, what you call them, RJ45 splitters. And this one is unique in a way that all of these ports are connected on the PCB inside here. So what I'm going to demonstrate is how you can use this to extend your uh, little home automation Modbus yeah, setup. So picture you have uh, this module yeah, and the Arduino, this bit, on one segment somewhere at home. And this bit, as you can now see, is on the separate one. So you got this and now somehow we need to connect this bit to a uh, wire somewhere that goes back to, uh, you know, the other side. So what you can do is obviously have this. Imagine this being like a 50 meter wire, which I already did like a demo might show, uh, give you a link there. However, okay, you might just get away with using this one because it's a splitter. Yeah, not an economizer, it's a splitter. So I can connect this, grab one of these bad boys, connect this and pick any any hole here and uh, it still works, yeah, as to be expected. So even if I change it to here, now the other one, it still works perfectly fine. Now, even if I go crazy, I think I showed this before, connect them together like this still works because it has to this this is not behaving like your typical uh, Ethernet uh, cable it just behaves like a uh, you know you're creating a wire that these can just use and it happens just that this is all connected internally so you can go a bit crazier obviously if you need to add more nodes to your, uh, what you call it, Modbus network. And you can literally daisy, daisy chain them, link them together, however, whatever the phrase is, and you can literally connect these up. Hopefully this will make some sense. Yeah, <laughs> this is still working. So you can go as crazy as you want, even connecting them this way around. Yeah, it will not matter for the setup at all. So I think this is rather amazing because here I can have like another, uh, you know, uh, node in the house and you can just keep adding and adding. So you can have like a virtual wire. I'm not even sure how to call this. Uh, just by the uh, virtue of adding these uh, splitters not economizers, again, these are splitters. They're usually sold as a pack of one because you don't need two, as usually you will get with those, uh, the splits and it allows only one ethernet uh, cable to work at a time. But uh, the different story, I, I bought some of those, had to return them because the description was misleading. So yeah, as you can see, this is uh, <laughs> rather cool. So you can connect them up however way you want and uh, it'll still work so yeah that's all i really what i have for you today just an interesting uh, way of creating a diy home automation modbus driven uh, network with some nodes i will uh, be making one so you, i'll probably have like a wall mounted or something so you can see better what i'm trying to get at but yeah i think that's enough of my rambling and uh, yeah, thanks for watching.